Hey YouTube, XBMC Nut here. I just want to give you a long overdue look at my 10 inch Home Assistant Lovely Spaced Wall Tablet. Um, it's got a very high family acceptance factor. Um, so we come back and look at it on the wall. It actually looks like a um, photo frame. That's because it is in a photo frame or a picture frame and um, yeah, it took me about two weeks to build the Lovelace dashboard uh, and I'm using a combination of fully kiosk browser and browser mod which allows me to control the tabs that are on the screen so I've got um, that's the main dashboard and if we look up here I've got a thermometer dashboard which is currently unavailable so that's connected to a Weber uh, thermometer uh, meat cooking thermometer and that actually reads the temperature of the um, the meat that's cooking and it switches to that tab automatically using browser mode um, when someone rings the doorbell go back to the main tab when someone rings the doorbell it switches over to the camera and it stays on that particular screen for 30 seconds and then flicks back again and then uh, just for fun I added in some uh, uh, wind information for New Zealand on that tab but I don't actually use that it's just a bit of a party trick so what I'll do is I'll um, just pause the video and then we'll come back and have a look at how that's mounted to the wall Right here we are with the tablet removed and excuse my hole cutting there so what I've done is I've got a, um, a recessed power socket uh, mounted in the wall so that's got mains coming up and I've tapped that off from uh, a main socket in the ceiling and then we've got the 3M picture frame um, hooks there which are like a velcro uh, based stuff and uh, yeah this is when I went to cut the hole out um, I did put a uh, stud finder on there but um, what I didn't realize is there's a, um, a plastic pipe running down the wall which I, uh, I just about cut through so yeah use a better stud finder than the one that I used one that can find plastic pipes so yeah I've got four mounting um, positions there 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 and there and what that does if you look on the side is that when you mount the tablet um, because you've got the same 3M mounting strip on the tablet itself it gives you a, a very small air gap around so the air from the back of the tablet can actually get up and, and out so that's quite a cool feature and here we are at the back of the tablet itself so I've got the 3M stickies on the back of there and um, yeah I've got a um, just a, a 2 amp power brick there and what I did with a Dremel is this is just a standard um, picture frame and I just went to my local framers and I gave them the dimensions of the, the Samsung tablet that I had and they whipped this up in about 10 minutes for me so and it was about $25, $30 I think New Zealand dollars that's about 15 US dollars um, yeah so and it, it actually looks really really smart and yeah I just used a Dremel to to cut that out of there and just a couple of screws to hold the tablet in and there's actually a little bit of foam uh, just in there just to give it a bit of a, a soft edge and um, yeah it works really well and it looks great and here it is stuck back up on the wall again you can actually see the air gap um, running down there so that runs all round so we can let the heat right out of it so um, family use this all the time of course these um, being a touch screen these are interactive so I can turn the light on and behind me and the kitchen here and what I did with um, a uh, for what am I running in there hack so I've got a custom card mod in there which actually prints out the brightness level so I'm using circadian lighting for the kitchen and the lounge so when you turn those on um, you can see the brightness is at 92% uh, on those um, so that works well and these uh, canvas gauges down the bottom make it nice to see the uh, humidity and the temperature the pool is currently offline at the moment and um, I've actually hacked the spa pool so I've got a temperature um, with a, uh, a sonoff feeding back so 
um, that's real handy to have as well. Anyway, that's my uh, 10 inch Samsung tablet, uh, wall mounted in a standard picture frame. Hope you like it. Um, give it a thumbs up if you do. And if you think there's someone else that might like to do a similar thing, then uh, please feel free to share the video. Thanks for watching.